the concern with the wireless router is that and they're pretty strong this is not minimal exposure and it's happening twenty four seven so the safer solution and a good part of our program and the book is really focuses on safer solutions and this one's easy well sort of easy go back to the ethernet cable until you can get a fiber optic system and if you as long as you have a flat screen on the television the electromagnetic field from that or the computer sorry is not that powerful you don't want kids sitting right up a close against any computer or close to any television but if you do a radiation rescue of your office though the children can play there quite happily when you have replaced your cordless phones with corded your wireless with wired internet connection and uh, why we've got this um, this graphic about the penetration of cell phone radiation into the human skull and in an adult it goes part way through the skull in a ten-year-old it goes about halfway through in a five-year-old it almost fills the entire skull and I know we think believe me I have teens um, that are <laughs> the young people are pretty hard-headed but anatomically the the brain and the skull are not really fully formed until they're perhaps in their early twenties so for young children they're particularly vulnerable the skull is thinner the radiation permeates the brain is more aqueous um, they're really vulnerable and certainly pregnant women and a fetus an unborn child are really at risk